Hello everyone, welcome to my channel. This is Akshita Shetty and I have with me a very special guest today. Hi Nandipa. Hi Akshita. Hi. Welcome to my channel. Thank you. Welcome. So she is a qualified chartered accountant and a cost accountant and she has qualified CA in November 2019 and CMA in December 2020. She has also worked with EY and now she is serving as an assistant manager in finance and accounts at Kalon Limited. I welcome you to my channel. Thank you. Thanks. Since exams are around the corner, I have invited Ms. Nandipa to give some exam tips for all our viewers. Alright guys, can you please let us viewers know what inspired you to take up CA course? So, when I, when I completed my plus two, my father asked me to take up CA. I was not interested at all. So, he took me to his relatives, friends who were aware of his course to convince me. So 
what I suggest is fix a time to chat or watch your favorite show and make sure you don't get distracted after that. And I don't suggest using social media during your preparation. Just focus that time, go for a walk or spend the time with your parents so that it improves your quality of preparation. Yeah. Correct. Maybe instead of social media, you can hang out with your friends or you can, you know, take a pet for a stroll or something like that. Yeah, yeah. Don't touch your phone, basically. <laughs> we are coming to the most hectic part, that is the articleship or internship, whatever you call it as. So, can you share your internship experience and how did you balance your studies and work? So, I have done my articles in Chennai. What I suggest is, first six months, you go, you take rest or take time to settle down. After that, you start preparation for the subjects like auditing, SFM. So, at least three hours a day. After that, because you know, after the study leave or something, six months, the, uh, the principal will give you six months leave, right? That time, you cannot cover everything. At least uh, finish your classes so that at least 40 percentage of the preparation is done. So, this is what I suggest during the article trip. One personal question also. Can you please share your stipend? I don't want to share. <laughs> that is a very huge amount. No, I cannot oh share. Oh my god. <laughs> okay, please give us the price band at least. Like how they give it to you. It is in the institute has declared some what, price band or what is it? Uh, the norm, standard norm. Band. Oh, just go and check in the website. Institute website. <laughs> okay. So work for the interviewer today. <laughs> Alright. Moving on to the exam preparation tips. Deepa, how many hours do you suggest to study? I don't count number of hours, okay? Because if you have that burning desire, you focus on that goal day and night. So, even in my case, when I was doing my preparation, I used to make a brief notes of sections, everything on a sticky notes, and I used to paste in all the rooms. So, whenever I go to that room, I used to revise that. I still remember I pasted section 327 of the company is that it's preferential payments on my refrigerator. So whenever I go to that room, I read that because I revised that formula or section whatever it may be. So I don't suggest the number of hours. It is depends on the quality and how much time you focus on the study. That's it. Right. As she said, quality matters and not quantity. Even if you study for four hours without concentration, the entire effort will go in. Yeah. Exactly. Moving on. Do attempts really matter in these professional exams or uh, do you get priority during job search? No, attempts do not matter at all. I have cleared my CA final in two attempts. First group and first attempt and second group and second attempt. I am strong in the second group papers rather first group papers. So, as you said in your, in your YouTube videos, right? If you <laughs> study for rank, you will pass in exams. Yeah. But if you study for knowledge, you will pass, you will pass in life. life career. So, attempts do not really matter. Knowledge is what matters yeah, yeah. when you enter the corporate world. It's not about first rank or second rank. Yeah, yeah. Alright, so we have almost reached the fat end of the video and uh, coming to the best part, I have not yet experienced that, but could you please You'll share experience soon? Yeah, yeah. <laughs> I'm waiting. So could you please share your memorable and the most precious convocation experience? Yeah, this is my favorite part of this video. <laughs> Convocation day has come in the month of February after COVID tried all it could. So after two years you got your convocation? Yeah, yeah, yeah. So during my convocation, this uh, institute gives members kit which contains badge, tie, oath, certificate and all. Yeah. So when I was doing my preparation, you know, that time I downloaded a picture of this and I kept it as my mobile wallpaper. Wow. Because as my motivation. Now when I received that kit, right, I felt like this is what I dreamt of. The dream come true yeah, moment. Yeah, yeah, yeah. And I felt very nostalgic when I was sitting in the auditorium, remembering all my failures, struggles. Oh my god. And my parents' hard work, and of course, my principal too. So I feel every CA student should experience this cloud nine feeling. Wow, amazing, Deepa. I think I can feel the goosebumps moment. <laughs> I wish all of you will experience this moment super soon. Alright Deepa, this is my treat for you Thank for coming you. and 
shooting this video for me. Thanks, Akshita. Welcome. I'm really glad that you came as soon as I called for this interview. It's okay. Thank you. I hope this video was extremely useful to you all, and I have brought Nagdeepa only for the benefit of you all. Okay. So good luck for all your exams and keep supporting me. Thank you. Do not forget to like, share, and subscribe to my channel. Until next video. Bye bye. All the best, guys. Please like, share, subscribe to Being Aksh. Thank you. Bye. Bye bye.